What's going on guys? Dave Sharp here, co-founder of Empower Network and you know true truthfully I am just absolutely like out of my mind exhausted because we've been here to my in Miami uh, for I think like five or six days now uh, working on a secret secret really secret project that a lot of you are probably gonna see maybe by the time you see this video maybe not um, anyways we're probably see some of the city in the background right now we're actually sitting inside we snuck out here just to kind of look at this epic view and Dave and I were on our way over to the restaurant tonight kind of cruising down South Beach in this Audi R8 you know with a V10 engine it's kind of weenie it didn't have the V12 but you know it was V10 so it was all right and anyways I was just sitting back in the seat and I've been thinking about this a lot about you know how really actually grateful that I am uh, and I believe that um, I'll tell you a little story about just gratitude in my life. Five and a half years ago when I got clean, um, it's amazing because sometimes you'll be in a really crappy situation and you'll be in this predicament or situation that you know you just can't wait to get out of. You sit there every day and you think about what it would be like if you weren't in it anymore, whether it be an addiction like what I was struggling with, homelessness, being broke, being miserable, being you know really having a life that uh, nobody really should be living, right? And then I wanted nothing more than to get out of that situation. I was in this mindset that maybe I can do it, but because of how long I'd been in that rut, I wasn't sure. Anyways, I obviously got out of it. And it wasn't 60, 90 days later, I remember myself thinking, oh, well, if, I, if it, it could only be like this. When just literally 90 days ago, I was in, you know, 10 times of a, of a more worse situation, right? And I had people around me, thank God, people who knew more than I knew, who had more experience than I had, and they said, Dave, in situations like this, and really they said a lot more assertively and, and really kind of gave me the kick in the ass that I needed, but they said, dude, sounds like you need to make a gratitude list, right? And the funny thing is, is that five and a half years later, I can be in a situation to where everything can be great around me, right? And I'll still kind of get in this mindset only really because I'm human, right? And I see so many people out there who are in situations that are really much better than, you know, 90% of people out there inside of this mentality that they wish things could be a certain way. And the truth is, is that maybe, just maybe, you need to make a gratitude list and look around at the things that you have in your life. Look at the fact that you do have a car. Look at the fact that you may want to build a business and you may want to become an entrepreneur, but maybe you just have a job right now and you're paying your bills and you're putting a roof over your kid's head. You know, whatever the situation is, that sometimes in order to get to the next level, we got to be grateful for where we are, right? And today, on a, on a movie shoot down here, we've got 25, 30 really talented people. We flew down leaders from all over the country to be with us we've got staff we're hiring new people we're growing we're building internationally people are making good money and most most importantly we're helping bring other people up but I still have got to realize that guy actually farted just right there man oh dude he's got a bacon strip in his pants it's odd but uh, uh, anyways, just, you know, he was trying to ruin my, my, my video here. You know, you've got people like that in South Beach, but you're going to call them out and play along. Anyways, guys, life is good, right? Life is good, right? And it was even good when it was bad. It's all about your perspective, right? So what I want you to do is I want you to look around because I know where you want to go, but first you've got to recognize where you're at and be grateful for something, right? Because an attitude of gratitude will get you a lot further than an attitude of entitlement. Uh, guys, you deserve success. You deserve to be in the places that you know you can be, and you deserve to have the things that uh, is out there for you, really for the taking. So, as we're sitting down here in Miami, I'm gonna get back in there and finish my dinner. Uh, I wanna leave you just with that thought to look around and realize that there's this amazing world out there that is literally at your fingertips, right? But sometimes you've got to look at what you already have and say, damn, I'm grateful I have that. Because there's a lot of people who aren't willing to do that. And when you do that, 
right? You put yourself in a position of being empowered to take the next move instead of acting like a victim or instead of acting like uh, you're entitled to something, which is what 95, I would say, and if you listen and pay attention to things that people say, it's really apparent and obvious why they're in the situation they are. So guys, I love you. I appreciate you. This was just something that literally just came to my mind here uh, two seconds ago as I was walking out here next to the water and kind of looking at this amazing view that we have, being grateful for the people that we have around us and the opportunity really that's in front of us. So you know what? Let's do it.